how to control Google ads with keywords means that if you pick the wrong keywords, your cost is going to go drastically up or down. And you might even pick the right keyword, but you might have the wrong match type. So in Google ads, it's the words and the match type that make up the keyword. It's not just the combination of words, it's also the match type. And if you pick the wrong one, what ends up happening is you end up spending potentially loads of money wasted on clicks that are irrelevant. Let's say that you are a paint contractor and you have a keyword called paint contractors near me. And if that key phrase is broad, then what it allows Google to do is take any one of the terms, paint contractors near or me, any one of those words in there, and it allows them to ditch all the other words and then to find synonyms. So if I, if I have a keyword paint contractors near me as broad, it could get rid of all the other words except paint. And then it could create a synonym called painter. And then it could say like artist painters near me. And that's how wild it could get, right? So you could be targeting an artist studio, or if anyone's ever been to one of those places where everyone comes in and has a you know a couple of beers or wine while you're painting, that kind of business could trigger your ad and get you clicks and cost you money, even if you're trying to do paint contractors. So here's the thing, to control Google ads costs with your keywords, you need to make sure that you have the right keywords in your account. So take a look at the specific services, watch all of the match types, make sure that you're picking phrase or exact matches so that you don't waste money on other clicks.